Hi, my name is Henry. I work in the marketing department and I will be spending the next few days at the hose stores learning how we make hose, the best way to make hose, the safest way to make hose, things like that. So come with me and we will learn some together. So when you bring the hose in, when a customer brings a hose in, I look at a lot of different things other than just a hose. Um, this one, of course, he brought it in due to failure. And I see, it looks like obviously where the failure mark was at. Um, just doing an assessment from, from you know, just knowledge. Uh, I look at the hose, I feel the hose. I can feel that it's a little stiffer than it ought to be. But also I see the heat cracks that are in the external cover. And if you evaluate the blowout here, you can see that it blew from inside out, um, which then um, most likely came from heat. Um, from doing so um, and then we start to ask the customer um, you know if, if he's having heat issues what's the proper application uh, things of that nature just so we can uh, try to make sure we put the proper hose back on there if even if it's been replaced wrong in the, in the past um, so but that's 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 just um, stuff that we try to ask when they come across from the counter just so we can help try to make safe that air brake yes okay cool oh, but, uh, brake chamber yeah yeah, um, but don't put the pressure fittings. Can you do like some JIC or something? Yeah, you want to go back to JIC or the SAE adapter? Okay, yeah, so we can do that.